When using a Maestro compatible multimedia receiver that has multiple assignable camera inputs, the Maestro RR enables the rear, front, and side cameras to work seamlessly in the vehicle, similar to the way these cameras work when factory installed. For these features to work, both the vehicle and the receiver must support this functionality. Check the fit guide at www.idanalinkmaestro.com for vehicle and receiver compatibility. Smart Parking provides the driver the ability to automatically switch between front and rear cameras with the vehicle's gear placement. This feature can assist you in parallel parking. To enable Smart Parking, you must first assign a front camera in the aftermarket radio setup menu. Refer to the owner's guide for instructions on where to find the camera assignment setup. Once the camera has been assigned, you need to turn Smart Parking on. Locate the OEM setup option in your Maestro compatible radio. Next, select Maestro features, then camera settings, then front camera control. Select Smart Parking from the menu and turn it on. When the vehicle is placed in reverse, the rear camera will turn on. When it is switched into drive, the front camera will turn on. This sequence will continue until you have completed parking. When reversing out of a parking spot, the front camera will switch on when the vehicle is placed into drive, but it will turn off when you exceed 10 miles per hour. The Maestro RR also provides a low speed trigger for the front camera. This feature will automatically activate the front camera at low speeds. This feature is used for parking in tight spaces and to help avoid hitting the curb when parking. To set up the low speed trigger, return to the front camera control menu in OEM setup. Select the low speed trigger and turn it on. Return to the previous menu and select the camera settings. There are four configurable settings for the low speed trigger. The on speed determines how slow the vehicle must be traveling for the camera to turn on. The off speed will turn the camera back off when the vehicle exceeds the selected speed. The time to on at low speed setting determines the amount of time you need to drive at or below the on speed for the front camera to activate. The time to off at zero miles per hour setting will delay the camera shut off once the vehicle has stopped. By adjusting these settings, you can change how the front camera works to find the best configuration for you. Once the vehicle has traveled under 9 miles an hour for 3 seconds, the selections made in our example settings, the front camera switches on. Once the vehicle is stopped, the camera will turn off after 5 seconds, which is the time selected in the settings earlier. In this example, the vehicle never exceeded 16 miles an hour, so the camera was never shut off by that setting. The side view camera settings will switch the radio screen to the driver side or passenger side camera when the turn signal is switched on. For this option to be configured, you must assign a camera to the driver or passenger side in the aftermarket radio setup menu. Once the camera has been assigned, we can turn on the activation with turn signal in the Maestro settings menu. Select side view camera, then auto side view camera. Now you can choose to have it come on whenever the turn signal is on or when the vehicle is traveling over 10 miles an hour or 40 miles an hour. You may also want to set a delay off for the side view camera. This can be done by selecting on after signal. You can delay the camera turn off time to two or four seconds after the turn signal has been switched off. If you leave this setting to off, the camera will shut off when the turn signal is switched off. Once these settings are configured, the camera will turn on when the turn signal is active. The off-road 4x4 trigger will turn the front camera on when the vehicle is placed into 4x4 mode. This feature is only available on specific vehicles. Please check our fit guide to see if your vehicle is compatible. To turn 4x4 mode on, go to the front camera control menu and select Off-Road 4x4 Trigger. You can set the on trigger to 4x4 low or 4x4 high and low. Once the vehicle is placed in 4x4 mode, the front camera will turn on. 
For more information on iDatalink Maestro products, please visit us at www.idatalinkmaestro.com.